strapping fellow in a leather jacket is me, Evan McRyan. The second guy in uniform, General Grummet. Now Grummet thinks I'm a bulked out mercenary, but he needs me. And the 10,000 pounds that the General will give me for the head of Dr. Strauss is a huge reason to help the poor fool. Anyway, the risk of stabbing him back from Afghan savages is no less dangerous than walking a city full of rabid mechanical beings. But the last opportunity pays better. This is real war. There are no humans on the streets of the capital. Only mechanical monsters and configurations. And all this because of one balmy genius and the complete approval of the Gilded Chamber. General, I hate pathos. Let's get back to meat. I need you to bend towards our line of resistance and to find the person in this mess that is responsible for all this madness and to bring me his head, the head of the blundering Dr. Strauss. Or what else? McRyan? There is no other option. I'd rather die here and now. Any other suggestions? Five thousand pounds. Ten, and it's settled. McRyan? Okay, eleven. Nine for me, and two for you. Just don't scream anymore, Grummets. You will get your pass and weapon from Carpenter on the way out. Your task is to explore all points of Strauss's believed location. Find him and destroy. Get ready. Steam Towers detect a human presence on the main square. Everybody ready. McRyan, this is Lois speaking. Call me Angel. I will guide you. You have been detected. Watch out. Shield! Do not shoot him in the head. We will use his brain. Ryan, do not let me down. You know the deal. We stay in contact, over and out. McRyan.
are a mess. Checkpoint reached. Shotgun. Weapon power up. Marvelous. 